Hi, everybody. My name's Angelina from Wild 94.9, the Bay's number one hit music station. One of the first to play, Lauren Spencer Smith. First things first, congratulations on everything, because I feel like we were literally just watching you tease, fingers crossed, on TikTok. And the next thing you know, I Heart Radio on the Verge artist, just got done performing at Jimmy Fallon, just doing everything right now. Um, it seems like it was so quick, but I know it wasn't overnight for you. How has this journey been for you? Yeah, it's been very crazy, um, very long. Like, I feel like a lot of people are like, oh my God, overnight. And like, yes, overnight, but like also absolutely not at the same time. Um, but it's been so fun, so crazy. Like, met so many just amazing people along the way. No, your journey has been so amazing. Yeah. Uh, I do have to, I want to talk about Flowers real quick. It's one of the songs she didn't perform, but it's, uh, okay, sorry, but Flowers yeah, Supremacy, so Flowers Supremacy <laughs> in the front. Um, I love that record so much, and I do feel like there's a lot of simil similarities to Fingers Crossed. Would you consider that like a part two almost to that uh, song? Yeah, it's about the same dude. <laughs> same dude, same yeah. trauma. <laughs> yeah, same guy. Te I mean, like, technically it's about, like, the moving on from it. Like, I met my boyfriend, and I didn't know how to fall in love because of the fingers crossed dude, but right. same dude. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I think that's like one of the things we all love about your music is like how real and authentic it yeah. is, especially with the song Narcissist. Mm -hmm. You're, she's only 18 years old. <laughs> to be able to make a song about, you know, awareness about dealing with someone who's a narcissist, what was the inspiration behind the song? Same dude, again. <laughs> we went through a lot. What was the situation, yeah. what was the situation? Um, I mean, like I have, had a lot of people in my life that have had like narcissists in their life and I thought it was like just one thing I was never going to write about because I was like no one would relate to this like this is such a rare thing and my mom actually started sending me like all these links and videos on YouTube from like this doctor that like studies narcissism <laughs> and he knows I've done my research um, <laughs> and I started watching all these it. videos and then I was like wow my ex is a major narcissist and I was like wow I know like other narcissists and the more people I spoke to they were like same like this is actually something I've been going through and I was like okay I have to write about it because more people are going through it than you I did thought. did research on this song. Yeah, Dr. Romani. <laughs> go follow her if you're struggling, guys. I need to collab with her for sure. And I always watch your TikToks. Your boyfriend, Matt, this is not yeah, the person not the, the songs person. are about. Okay. <laughs> Don't cancel him. Don't come in Matt's DMs because people have been coming for him. They're like, like, yeah, Don't, we're like, we hate better. you. Like, don't do wrong to her. He's like, I can literally never <laughs> break up with this girl. <laughs> That makes me so happy because you're like super in love now. Yeah, obsessed. And, and then people are like, why is she writing all these sad songs? I'm like, I'm sorry. Well, I was going to say for your future songs, do you think like being in a healthy relationship now has changed how you write music? Yeah, like there's happy songs, but there's, we have a lot of, lot to dig through. We, we, from we my still past. got some healing to do. <laughs> yeah. We still got to put it out there. Uh, so what is next for you? Mm, that is a great question. Uh, we start tour tomorrow. Um, so we're touring. I've been writing just a lot of music, so more songs, more music. I've been writing Christmas music, so oh. we're hoping to release a Christmas song. Um, but yeah, just touring and being on the road. We need a Christmas album for yeah. sure. It's already <laughs> written, but oh, yeah. But I think I might have to wait till next year. <laughs> no, I'm so excited for your future. You killed it today. Everyone, give it up again for Lauren Spencer Smith. Thank you so much.